Google announced new Nexus branded products recently, including the Nexus for smartphone and the Nexus 7 and Nexus 10 tablets. With its new lineup of Nexus gear, the Nexus 10 is Google's answer to Apple's iPad 4, complete with stereo speakers, front and rear cameras, 1.7 GHz dual core processor, 2 GB RAM, and either 16 or 32 GB storage options. This impressive hardware sits behind a display boasting the highest resolution of any tablet on the market with a pixel density of 300 pixel per inch, far greater than the iPad's 264 pixel density. Apple's Retina branding doesn't seem all that impressive anymore. The Nexus 10 is encased in unibody plastic chassis, which Google says is an essential feature in order to ensure the device is as thin, light and affordable as possible. One major weakness for Android thus far has been lack of tablet-optimized apps. To remedy this, Google is making a major push to get more of these apps from developers. When you combine the Nexus 10's price, power, technology, and multi-user support, Google really have built a tablet that goes toto with iPad in almost every way, and in many cases outshines Apple's offering altogether. It will be fascinating to see how well the Nexus 10 fares against the iPad this holiday season. Google also announced the Nexus 4 mobile phone which features wireless charging and an enhanced camera that allows users to create immersive panoramas covering all the angles they can see in the same manner as Google's Street View technology. The Photosphere technology is part of the Android 4.2 software upgrade. It will also add updates to Google's Now software that aims to provide updates users need before they ask. It will now include updates on packages that are being delivered as well as new local photographs in addition to flight information and currency conversion when users are traveling. It was reported that Google's Android operating system will be used on more computing devices and Microsoft's Windows within four years. Data from research firm Gartner showed, underlining the massive shift in the technology sector. At the end of 2016, there will be 2.3 billion computers, tablets, and smartphones using Android software, compared with 2.28 billion Windows devices, Gartner data showed. That compares to an expected 1.5 billion Windows devices by the end of this year against 608 million using Android. Android, which reached the market only in 2008, has risen fast to be the dominant smartphone platform, controlling two-thirds of that market. It has taken the no-to spot in the fast-growing tablet computer market. Android ASUS Google LG Mobile Post Cross Nexus Nexus 10, Nexus 4, Nexus 7 owns a pre-order smartphone video.